In this video, we're talking about division by zero and the fact that dividing by zero is actually undefined in math. Let's look at a couple of examples to illustrate why sometimes people get confused. In this first example here, we have fractions two over one times one over two. We want to multiply these together. Remember when we multiply fractions, we multiply the numerators together. So our numerator is two times one, we get two. In the denominator, we have one times two or two, two over two, is equal to one, and that's fine. But in this case, we multiply our numerators together, we have two times zero is zero, and our denominators zero times two, we also get zero. So comparing this to our first example, where you have two over two is equal to one, you might say zero over zero is equal to one. But in fact, that's not true. Zero over zero is not equal to one, it is undefined, and that's because zero is a special number. We can't treat it exactly the same as we do non-zero numbers, and one of the ways it's not the same is that we can never divide by zero. So zero over zero is gonna be undefined, and even if we just have some constant value in the numerator and just zero in our denominator only, that's still gonna be undefined. We can never do this. We can never have zero in our denominator. So this value is not equal to one. In fact, it's undefined. And it doesn't matter what we might be multiplying by zero in our denominator. If we have a zero in our denominator, it'll be undefined. So let's look at this other example here to show that this is also undefined. If we multiply our numerators together, we get three times zero times y. Well, because we're multiplying by zero, we're still just gonna get zero in our numerator. In our denominator, we have zero times x times four, and it doesn't matter that we're multiplying by x and four because anything multiplied by zero is still zero. So we still end up here with zero over zero, and of course we know that that is undefined. Looking at this example over here, when we multiply our numerators together, we get AB times three, or in other words, three AB in the numerator. And in the denominator, we have zero times zero, which we know is zero. And here, even though we have a non-zero value in our numerator, three AB, we still have a zero value in our denominator, which is not allowed. And so we say that this is also undefined. We can never divide by zero, this here is not acceptable. So for all three of these examples, we can't come up with a real number answer. They're all undefined. 